begin this one. I got the news today that a very dear woman named Nancy passed away this afternoon from ovarian cancer. It was her 50th birthday. Kind of poetic. So every time we think of her passing, it's on the day that we would be celebrating her life which she celebrated so heartily. <laughs> anyway, it made me think about the day we met, she and I. Um, the last couple of years, I've uh, participated in the Teal Walk for Ovarian Cancer in Brooklyn, and that's where we met. And the moment we encountered each other, we exchanged this cosmic-sized hug. We just held each other for probably only a couple of seconds, but it felt like forever. <laughs> and she stepped back from our embrace <laughs> and smiled at me and said, we're going to get along famously because I'm a hugger too. <laughs> so just thinking a lot about this simple act of a hug and how much it can mean to someone in any moment. So simple and easy to do. And it means so much. And there are no words. <laughs> it can mean I love you. I support you. I'm here for you. You're not alone. And it's so important to just take a moment to hug, hug someone. <laughs> if they're going through a struggle, hug them. If they're really succeeding at something, hug them. <laughs> there are a lot of times in our lives when it's hard to articulate something, can't find the words, and we're compelled to use words and we can't find them. And a hug is always available. So, hug someone today. Hug someone every day. And if you're by yourself, hug yourself. <laughs> it means the world. <laughs>